All right, uh, I haven't recorded for a few days, but today, as I turn it on just as we enter a pretty dark tunnel, we are on uh, the very southern end of the Blue Ridge Parkway. Some pretty nice scenery out here. It's heading towards, not that we're going in, but heading towards Smoky Mountain National Park, I think. Just gonna spend a couple days following the Blue Ridge Parkway if I don't run into people by crossing the center line. And it's uh, much to J.H. Bart's chagrin, a very curvy, windy, mountainy type road for 400 and some miles. I couldn't tell you exactly how long it is, with evidently tunnels throughout. I've never been on this road before. I've been on an extension of it, Skyline Drive, up in Shenandoah National Park, which I plan to do the latter part of tomorrow. It, it's really shady and sunny. I'm struggling with... I have dark sunglasses, so I don't know if I should just put on my regular glasses and suffer through the sunny parts, or keep on my dark sunglasses and suffer through the dark shady parts. But, pretty famous road, Blue Ridge Parkway. Alright, just a, a view from up here and a, one of the pull-offs on this road. See all the clouds, see why they refer to them as the Smoky Mountains around here. Just another view from another viewpoint. What's what's really cool is quite often uh, right on the top of the mountain, hence the name Ridge, and you have these views on both sides of the road. It's just it's it's pretty spectacular stuff. Look at all those trees. riding along I've been seeing stuff like this all day long both sides of the road it is really quite exceptional my ISO is kind of high so it's bright out here for you Let's see if I can change that's a little bit better there are towns down in these valleys, there's farms, there's all kinds of there's roads. But this Blue Ridge Parkway just kind of keeps going. It, it uh, Every once in a while it has a road that comes in to get you in and out. But there's no driveways, there's no businesses. It's, it's run by the National Park Service and it's... Uh, it's really pretty cool. It's still on the bright side though as I look through this camera. Just another view out the passenger window, so I'm trying to make sure I don't run off the road while showing you this. I like the idea of showing it to you, but I like the idea of not running off the road better. Good morning. We are on day two of the Blue Ridge Parkway. Yesterday was a bright, sunny, dry day. Today is a cloudy, kind of humid day, but cool enough at this point, anyhow. And uh, as you can see, the road is, uh, at this point... We're in the northern part of it. A lot less uh, mountain type curves and roads and just cruising along. I, I don't know. We've got a ways to go. I'd say another hour and a half, two hours. But uh, just, just a different type of, of ride at this point. I'll tell you, I was on 
the road a little later than I expected to be last night. It was the sun was not set, but it was starting to get there, and uh, like out of nowhere, hundreds of deer popped up along the road, eating on his, off the grass here and everything. And, and uh, I had to slow down a little bit. I've never seen so many deer in my life, but uh, it's. I don't know if they're not hunted around here because it's federal or, or they're just that many of them, but uh, fortunately, my vehicle evidently is an aerodynamic brick and makes noise because it startled a whole bunch of them to move away from the road as I was coming through. So anyhow, back at it this morning and uh, no animals yet. I don't know where they go during the day, but man, they were out. In the evening last night. All right, here's a view from Taylor Mountain, elevation 2,543 feet. The highest point on the Blue Ridge Parkway it was in North Carolina. It was just over 6,000 feet. And I'm going to keep this running. I'm going to go back in the vehicle, and I'm just going to pull out onto the road and show you the view from the other side. It's like we're on the top of the mountain. Not buckling up at this point, so we might get some bongy, but I don't want to bore you with watching while I buckle. Watching nothing. So, this is the pullout. And we're just going to come over to the other side. There's where we just were. And this is the view from this side. It's just really something. Views on both sides, you're riding along the top of the mountains. And so you get to see both sides. Alright, I am at Rock Point Overlook. I gotta go check my lighting, it still looks pretty bright. Uh, all that moving the camera around, I hit some dials. So some of this stuff might be pretty bright stuff, but anyhow. We're at Rock Point Overlook. Got some farms, got a, maybe little villages down there. Just really cool. And a lot of mountains. 